Hello everybody, and welcome back to Call of Cthulhu. Just, uh, you know, some silly occult business going on. How you doing? I have it. It's a strange amulet. I hope it will protect you, considering that nothing will help you change your mind. You must understand, I already went too far. What have you seen that's so hmm. terrible you convinced yourself that you had to risk so much? I can't tell you now. This story oh, is going to end badly. Yes, here. it is. Chief West is here with Sullivan. Where? Wait, Bradley. where? You take care of Sarah. I will deal with that. You sure? All right. Wait. That's less than ideal. The hell's going on here? What you two want? I've been hearing about you a lot lately. Thank you. You seem to enjoy causing trouble. Nice job, Chief. You got me. Great police. You can try to play smart with me all you want, Pierce. Hmm. Witnesses have identified you as the one who set fire to Riverside. Witnesses? How convenient. Riverside? That's not the whole story. Oh. You know, it was. We I actually did do that. Your stories. Save them for the judge. We, we did. We did set fire to Riverside. That That, you know, that is true. Us cops. We base our investigation on facts and testimony. Try that next time. <laughs> you bet I will. Why is it that the only time the cops can be helpful is when they're blaming us for something that we actually did? Like, not helpful, but like useful. Because. Wow, that was. <laughs> I didn't realize I was there. All right, Chapter 10, Darkwater Police Station. With the help of Algernon Drake, Pierce has obtained an amulet that is supposed to protect Sarah Hawkins against evil powers that covet her. The painter told him of her desire to track and kill the dimensional shambler in order to atone for her sins. Before Pierce could stop her, he was arrested by the police. That's good. Oh, the layout of the desks, we're absolutely going to sneak through that room. 100%. 100%. It's just so... Video gave me the layout. You know, I've heard a lot about you, Mr. Pierce. Thank you. All good, I hope. It appears that you've been involved in a variety of misdemeanors since your arrival on Dark Water. Probably. Entering private property twice. Aggression. Hmm. Insulting behavior. And to top it all, arson. Is insulting behavior a crime? Who? Fuller, probably. Because he survived. With all the liquor that is openly on sale in the middle oh. of Prohibition, do you really want me to believe that you're enforcing the law? Enough of that. You're not going to tell me how to do my job. Damn I would straight like to I will. point out that it is you, not me. Who is behind bars? There are things going on right now that are so much more serious than what you accuse me of. Yeah? So what's going on that I don't know about? Oh, here's the part where you start, uh... You start talking about the cult, and you go, Oh, oh the cult! And they go, alright, he's a fucking insane. But you try to explain it, and it's like, oh, oh, the cult, they're doing this and this, and you just, you seem insane. You'd be better off taking an interest in Dr. Fuller. The experiments like he carries out on his patients are as inhuman as they are illegal. And when Dr. Colden wanted to put a stop to it, she too went under the knife. What are you talking about? Nobody's reported any wrongdoings. I'm reporting Dr. it right now, Fuller asshole. Is a man who is as much respected and admired on the island as he is in his profession. It seems like you've got a grievance against him. Is that why you set fire hmm. to his institute? I'm admitting nothing at all. Come on, I'll show you to your new residence. I'll be back later to ask you some questions. I hope that you'll make the right choice and confess to everything. 
It would be as unpleasant for you as it would be for me if I had to adopt more advanced questioning. Are you threatening I have no me? Doubt about that. Good night, Mr. Pierce. Have a good night. Mr. Pierce. Oh the shit. That's not good. Who's there? Oh boy. Yeah, that's probably not good. Oh shit. The one men named Leviathan. Not because of the scale of my terrestrial form, but as a reminder of the immensity of my knowledge. <laughs> That's not good. Which I came to share with you, human. Oh boy. Do not struggle. You will not be able to speak. Or escape my influence. I mean, <laughs> no, I told you to behave. I told you to fuck off. You are here to access the knowledge and follow the path that leads to your freedom. This is an offer that the likes of you, particularly those with such rare characteristics, cannot refuse. The more rare characteristics. You your human spirit to make it able to receive the truth, the closer you will come to embrace his power. Where is the Oracle, Truth Seeker? Would you like to see mm -hmm. her? No. No. Your mind must open itself willingly, or the truth will immediately shatter it. Our paths shall cross again, truth seeker. That's okay. It feels like if I wanted to see her, that it would let him through me see her. If you happen to use your powers again, you you may lose more than your life. It is not about me, but innocent lives. I hope that your sources are reliable. The bootleggers have the painting. If the dimensional shambler is to appear, he will do it here. <gasps> the shambler. I knew it! No! Not again! Huh. Oh, interesting. Algernon, come back! Hmm. It is Algernon. And the Shambler. That is not... Not ideal. It's him over there, maybe? Is that cat? The bootleggers. No way back. Oh. oh I like how that is actually a white dot there, but it's just out of reach. That's neat. Is that man dead? Hmm. Hmm. All right. This guy looks pretty How fucking dead. How many are there? It's not good. That is not ideal. Get through here? No. 
Is he like in jail or is he just taking a nap in there and doesn't want to be disturbed? I'm a little confused on that one. Oh, there's down here too. Oh my god. Did the Shambler tear through this place? Did Drake tear through this place? Drake seems like a maniac who could snap, I'll be honest. What's going on over here? I refilled my... Wait. Where did she find a fucking lantern from? Okay. Alright. Let's check over here real quick. I don't think there's going to be anything over here. Random chessboard. Um, Alright. What's going on, Drake? What's going on? Hey! You can't leave us! Sorry, old friend. But it's either you or me. No! What are you. No! Open! Open! Open up! Open this door! It's here. That is not good. Ooh. Why does it not give a fuck about either of them? Oh, that's why there's all the holes in the rock. Because it's crawling through them. Are you sure you want to do it? Let's go. Quickly, come with me. All right. Wait. Oh, the painting's right there. Wait, was it? Is this the same room we were in? How do we kill it? The Shambler can open breaches between dimensions. He uses glyphs as anchors to stay in our world. Oh. We must destroy these glyphs. Exactly. How can I find them? Why does he have the amulet? I will make the glyphs visible so you can revoke them. By doing so, this zone will be protected by a barrier. Perfect. Stay inside the shield. I'll create the protective barrier. Get back inside it as soon as you sense the slightest danger. Hmm. Well, this the first pretty... glyph must have appeared somewhere on the floor. Hmm. Interesting. Is it just gonna come out of one of these holes? So, last time. Symbol, Sarah. It should react to the light if you use your lamp. Ah. So last time, there was the Shambler. I'm gonna call it a fight. It wasn't really a fight. Um, where you stab the painting as Pierce. But, um, there was some mechanic with the lantern, the I felt like. Must have appeared somewhere on the floor. Yes. Unless you mean this glyph. But I don't think this is it. No. Um, there, I thought there was going to be some mechanic with the lantern. Because there were uh, little lantern filler things to fill it pretty much everywhere. And, um,. I just really thought there was going to be some sort of mechanic to, like, stunned or something. I just don't really know. There it is. The glyph. I can't move it. Is it acting against me? The ritual is working. Don't worry. It's just until I ward it off. Oh, no. The Wanderer is back. The glyph is really Okay. The symbol has been revealed. You know what you have to do, Sarah. So that's what the preview. Okay. Did that pop up last time during the the initial fight with the Shambler? 
Um, I don't feel like that tooltip pop up, popped up. That would have uh, that would have been really helpful. I'm not gonna lie. Where is the second glyph? Drake's like, you must go find it quickly. I'm like, I am using my eyes, buddy. That is what I'm doing. <laughs> Thank you, Zara. That, that I appreciate. I'll that. never forgive myself for this painting. Uh. <laughs> the second glyph must have appeared. Let's press on. Yes, I get it. Calm down. I'm not blind. I'm just. if I were it. The symbol must be he's getting stronger and more aggressive. If he catches up with you, try blinding him. <sighs> I guess that's cool to know, but uh Sup asshole. Oh, I'm really close to you. Lantern works in 360 or not. I would think it would, but I don't know for certain. You know, if I knew this mechanic. Matters get complicated. I must breach the barrier to ward off the creature. You okay. have to lure it in front of me, Sarah. Do you understand? Once it goes after you, I need you to guide it towards me. What about the secondary objective? Find and destroy the third glyph. Um. Yeah, like, I feel like that's the mechanic I was missing in the, um. Oh, it's We're like, it's there, got a little Sarah. glowing pile on. Fuck. I'm just blind. Uh, like. When Pierce was doing stuff with the Shambler, I feel like that's what I was really missing. I was trying to find. Release me now, Algernon. Bring it towards me. Shit. Also, I'm not sure that's entirely. This guy just has magic. Whoa! Well, that got a bit spooky. Let's go, Sarah. It's over. Do you hear something? Is she getting pulled in? I can hear him. Uh oh. He calls me. Sarah! No! Algernon. My old friend. It's too late. What happened to the symbol we were using to protect her? I must resist! Please! Don't! Drake, you want to, uh. intervene at all? Oh, maybe? No? All right, thank you, Drake. Well, shit. That is less than ideal. All right, I'm gonna read this now because I can't stop or start my recording without getting rid of the screen, so. <clears throat> 
Chapter 11, Dark War Police Station. Sarah Hawkins, together with Algernon Drake, managed to permanently drive back, drive the dimensional... Managed to drop... <laughs> Sarah Hawkins, together with Algernon Drake, managed to permanently drive the dimensional Shambler back at the end of a fierce battle. However, this feat of strength cost her what was left of her self-awareness. She has succumbed to the call of the myth. All right. Sarah Not good. Hawkins. Why did she do it? Damn it. I thought Pierce rejected the information. And if he got Did it without guest enjoy accepting our it, he'd break. Let me out of here. I'm warning you, Pierce. I want a short and clear-cut confession. Fuck you. Do you admit your guilt in the case brought before you? You don't have any idea what's happening on this damn island. Oh, Pierce, your Sandy's. We got a problem. Damn it, Sandy's not dropping. now. What is it this time? Captain Fitzroy, Chief. Some guys have ransacked Roy's bar. They went berserk, attacked the patrons, smashed the place up. It's chaos. Oh, shit, this has hit the fan. This is only the beginning. Let me out. <sighs> Let's go take a look. Tell Sullivan and Marshall to keep this one nice and warm till I get back. Are you stupid? Don't you understand? <sighs> That's the thing, like, you oh, can't... Goddamn idiots. You, you can't be like, oh, the cult, the cult, the cult. Because then it's like, oh, like, this man's insane. I'm going to rip the light out of the ceiling or something. Move the bench, rip the light out of the ceiling. That's actually stupid. It'd probably be using the bench to pry the door off its hinges. I kind of like ripping the light out of the ceiling, though, just to cause fucking chaos. Alright, well, next time I'm going to be ripping the light out of the ceiling and causing some much-needed chaos. Uh, there's not enough of it yet. Thank you for joining me, and I will see you next time.